Hello and welcome back to Kerbal Space Run. My god, it's been a while. In fact, also, it's also, um, <laughs> I just got a message that, okay, 15 minutes. I have 15 minutes to make this video before I get picked up to go work. So, all right, so I lost track of what I was thinking already, but this is the G14 Mangle. If you don't remember my video on it, uh, yeah, I did a video on it. It is an awesome aerodynamic. Wow, it's been a while since I've looked at it even, so I, I forgot how striking the appearance of it is. But yes, this is the G14 Mangle. It's super fast, super high G maneuverable plane. Let me turn off the flag because it doesn't quite look as nice as I would like it to. Let's fly it. So today actually isn't uh, just me flying this around. It's actually a mod spotlight. Um, let's see. Is there a button for the mod? I, I see a thing here that I don't remember being there, but that might have been there and I just forgot about it. But yes, oh shit. I, um, whoops. I forgot to enable the SAS because I'm smart like that. Also, as you might have noticed, this is 1.0.4, which means I have those pretty turbojet effects now, as well as, uh, I think they've probably changed the flight model again a little bit. And, wow, that looks so cool. That looks really cool, actually. And uh, something else. What was I thinking? There's something else. Oh, yes, there's radiator parts, which I'm not going to show you because that's not what I'm focusing on today. Today, I'm focusing on this mod. Oh, it's not... I guess I'm not pulling up hard enough. Hold on. How many G's was that? Not enough. Alright, we need to go faster. Let's ditch those so we can go faster. Bye-bye, tanks. Bye-bye. Alright, come on. Come on, get to some serious speed. There you go. Okay, so I'm now going to go back in the cockpit. We're flying at uh, 337 meters per second. I'm going to pull up as hard as I can. And you notice the uh, screen starting to get a little bit dark on the edges of the screen in fact now it's getting significantly darker and as I keep pulling up I'm pulling high G's and you can see the screen is getting black around the edges this is tunnel vision so this mod adds tunnel vision from high G's so when you pull really high G maneuvers you will start to black out and in fact you can pull up hard enough for long enough to where you can actually completely black out although I seem to be avoiding that thus far so it's just very dark and then when I stop pulling really hard, you can see it brightens back up. There's also red outs, which is when you pull negative Gs. Whoa, and as you can see, that happens much, much quicker, which is why fighter jets typically pull up and they don't typically nose down as much because you can withstand a lot more Gs pulling up than you can pulling the other way, pushing the stick down. In fact, I'm not even starting to black out even slightly, although part of that's probably just the way I'm maneuvering is uh, not that crazy, but uh, let's go ahead and uh, go around the Space Center a little bit. We're running low on fuel already because this thing does not have a good fuel capacity. Let's go ahead and uh, get some altitude and then we'll do a red out and like a complete red out and see what happens, see if I like lose consciousness in this plane. And that's, that's about it. This is a mod that adds uh, effects when you pull high G's so that you you're actually like look like you're blacking out or redding out as the case may be okay I'm unconscious see it even says so Ooh, that is not good I'm pointing down I know I am am I am I conscious again I mean the message saying unconscious went away I'm pulling up slightly whoa oh shit I almost went out conscious again and I've run out of fuel whoo that was scary all right let's pull up really hard Although it's not going to do much. Let's pull down really hard. Although we're going slow enough now because we're out of fuel that uh, not really much of a danger there. I'm going to go ahead and put the landing gear down. I'm going to cut the engines. I'm going to uh, start pushing the brakes in a minute. And we're going to come in for a nice slow landing because this thing can. All right. Brakes. And we're kind of going slightly sideways. Oh, well. I'm not going to worry about it. In fact, I can actually pull up right above the runway and just kind of oh yep we've touched down and there you go that's how you land a plane after almost blacking out well actually no not almost blacking out redding out and becoming unconscious and then having to recover from that which in, with, that was really scary I'm gonna do it again in fact instead of just doing it again I'm gonna go to the uh, SPH and just stick a massive engine in the middle of this well not a massive engine it's just gonna be another one of these turbo jets but yeah I'm gonna make this even faster okay that's that's about the right angle, although we're going to go ahead and rotate this as well, as well as move it slightly. There you go. I look slightly off, but don't worry about it. All right, so we're going to... All right, we're going to do that, and we're going to do this. We're going to bring it right down here. All right. Might be sticking out awkwardly in the front. Doesn't look like it is, though. Hold on. Let's see. 
tip of it goes in right there. Yeah, so it's it's actually all right. All right, and uh, I guess I should call this the uh, GI GI 14 Mangle 3. No, B. B. Okay, I'm gonna actually save that. So basically, we've proved that <laughs> that's a bit unstable. That's gonna be fun. All right. So basically, we've proved that a red out is very easy to accomplish. And oh, that needs to um. Let's just give that another stage. Oh. All right. Put on the uh, pull up. Pull on the put on the pull up. Yeah. Uh, pull up the landing gear and pull up a little bit. Yeah, that engine is slightly counterbalanced to the other ones, which is not the best thing, but uh, oh well. All right, so we're getting up to the same amount of speed. Well, not the same amount of speed just yet. Okay, now we're getting faster, and it looks like we're not gonna go much faster than this. So let's go ahead and pull up as hard as we can. wonder what's gone wrong. Well, we don't have engines anymore. No, wait. Technically, it says we have one. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to quickly strut that up and try one more time. And I'm actually just about out of time, so I'm going to hurry up and hope this goes well. That shadow of those is going a bit wrong, which is interesting. All right, come on, let's get off the ground. Gear up. All right. High speed. High speed. Come on. All right, I think that's high enough speed. Let's go ahead and pull up. Oh, we've just done a backflip. And now we're flying uh, at a weird curve sideways backwards. Oh my god, I just did a stoppy in a plane, basically. Stoppy? Eh, yeah, sort of like a stoppy. I don't know. I did I did a just I just went, you know what? I'm gonna go the other way now. That's basically what I just did. Alright, I'm gonna try from the external view, just kind of whoa. That's not what I meant to do at all. This thing uh, suddenly is not the most uh <laughs> stable craft. That extra engine adds quite a bit of alright, let's see if we can Oh nope, without completely losing control, let's see if we can get constant high G's. Come on, come on. No, we're not we're not getting enough high G's. We're not getting nearly enough high G's. I guess it's time to red out again because we can definitely do that. All right. And wait, wait, let's go upside down, maybe even like facing the ground a bit, and then let's just No. Oh, it doesn't work very well for that either. <laughs> Part of that may have just been to do with the uh, speed we were at. But uh let's go ahead and go this way a bit. Oops, no, not that way. Oops. Nope, nope. Okay, that's kind of what I wanted. Come on. Red out. Red out. Red out. Yeah. Looks like uh, my whole idea of add more engines to increase stupidity of dying of high Gs or whatever just was not a good idea. And uh, maybe if we flew higher and did some extreme maneuvers, maybe we could get some more Gs up there. I am uh, just about running out of time, though. So I'm going to have to try and... Yes. Yes. I know. I'm going to have to uh, try and... Oh, that's the wrong button. <laughs> let's go. Uh, let's go up. Whoa! Well, that went a bit. Uh, just a little bit. Wow. That was crazy. Also, that was supposed to be muted. You just heard a thing from an alert, and that was supposed to be muted. And I, I muted it, but apparently I didn't. I, I swear to God, I muted it though. I don't know why I didn't mute. Hey. Let's see how well we can survive using air brakes, because they are slowing us down, gradually, very gradually. Not nearly fast enough, probably. It's too bad this engine is uh, practically useless, sitting back there. Uh, yeah, we're going to hit the water like a brick. And we're dead. Alright, I've had much more success with the uh, blacking out, not blacking out, redding out, passing out with this design. So we're going to go ahead and go back to this one for now. Let's go ahead and drop those. Very nice. Okay. So, higher speed, higher speed. Nope, we're already at maximum, well, maximum throttle, not maximum speed yet. But let's go ahead and pull up anyhow. And... There we go, we can get the nice blackout effects again, tunnel vision. I'm just kind of sad that I can't quite make myself blackout entirely. And just get it to about here. Redding out is much easier. I say as I completely fail to do that. <laughs> Hold on, let me get um, 
I get a bit higher speed. Alright, let's go aiming down and then pull up really hard and... And I've now blacked out. Well, read it out into unconsciousness. And if you heard my phone go off, that's probably because I'm being told to... Uh, uh, yeah, I'm being told to leave. Oh, and I'm aiming down. So let's uh, let's go ahead and uh, I'm gonna go ahead. And, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna land this from in the cockpit. Turn the engines up slightly. Hold on the brakes. Gear out. I really shouldn't put the gear out at this high a speed, but whatever. All right, I'm just gonna pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Let's go ahead and just pull up extremely. Not that extremely, but you know, extremely enough. Yes, I know, I know, I know. I'm going. I'm going. I'm just. Let me park. Let me park the damn plane. Let me turn off the engine entirely now, because I had it on still. Oh, I've just bounced on the ground. Come on. Oh, I'm still, I was still flying. Oh, that's, uh, I was starting to lose control a little bit there, but it's all good now. Slow it to a stop. There we go. The GI-14 Mangle will not cause you to black out, but uh, uh, you can red out in this, so uh, be careful. That is, of course, if you install the mod, which is called GFX. Thanks for watching. As always, see you in space.